Hello there, my name is Adaway. Welcome back to Germany and Japan in Hearts of Iron 4 with my good friend Count Christo. Ahoy. Well, we're having a great time okay. down in Spain. Alright. Well, just... Eventually, when well, I get down there, eventually. Who did you send volunteers to? Nationalists? Yeah, the I tried to send to Republicans, but they said no. <laughs> <laughs> they don't trust you. Apparently. Uh, I'm just setting up my port garrisons. I'm thinking, uh, I'm going to use these Manchukans to garrison all my victory points in central Japan. Like, if, if they start a civil war and declare war on me and try and get independence, this could go interestingly. <laughs> Why is it? Oh, right. I, I keep, uh, when I deploy units, I keep accidentally giving uh, field marshal fallback lines that you then can't assign units to from a general. Yeah, yeah that, 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 that frustrates me. No, I'm sure I'll get used to it. All right. The only other thing I would like I would like to do is I'd like to be able to. I'm not sure if this isn't this isn't in the new beta patch, but to if there's an, an army group of five armies. I want to just like select two armies and then command them individually separately from the other three. I just like shift click onto the next army. So, How do you mean control? Well, them? I mean, um. So you know, if you if you click on an army group, it it lists all the armies on the side. Yeah. All the five armies. You you can you can order them all around together as as an army group. All five armies. You can assign them to a front line or whatever. But I'm pretty sure you can't get order just two of them around. Yeah, well, you, so yeah I army, see a new one listening. All five. Don't use don't use field marshal orders. Don't do it. It's bad. Yeah, because it's, it's because of that problem. It's a trap. No, because uh, it's what causes the holes in the front lines. Because the game thinks you're trying to assign all five armies to it. Okay. If I get an example of what I'm talking about, I'll... Uh, all right, all right. I'm running out of building slots already. <laughs> I guess I should build something more expensive, like some synth refineries. Or even some... Uh, I guess I could do some infrastructure. Gee. Right, we're here. We've arrived. Oh, I arrived in the south this time. That's weird. Yeah, so did I, actually. Uh, I don't know. Strange. I don't know what controls never, that. I've arrived in Andalusia before. Oh, I didn't send. I didn't send air volunteers. Oh, good point. Yeah, shameful, I, guess I, was, I, send, I should send some. Uh, how did you just? Ah, you, uh, tick you, send volunteers, volunteers. Then you tick it, and then you just you just pull them down from wherever you are. Your wings. Request. Where's it? Take. How do? You, uh, no, I don't. I don't. I don't follow. How do I send the air volunteers? I click, well, like, you, you check you the just, box. You just click on your deployed planes in your country and mm -hmm. send them to the airbase. Spain. Oh, okay. I can send, like, 100 or something. 180, I think I can it says. send 200. All right, and then go down here. They don't appear to be flying there. Hmm. That's weird. They're still saying they're standing by. They might be flying there... Play the takeoff sound. You sure you don't just deploy them? Cannot create air wing in volunteer airbase. You can't deploy them in the airbase. You have to have the air wing already existing. That's my experience. My planes are now there. Oh, here we go. It's showing. It's showing numbers now. Okay, it's 171. I can find. Oh, that's cool. New new UI element on the. Uh... I can't believe I haven't done this yet. All right. Hey, now they're going over. Are they in deployment? Are they actually playing now? Why is there only 160 there, not 200? As I, I did send 200. New decision. Oh, I can yeah. prioritize something else now. But I think I want to just yeah, keep the, it. The, the, the air experience is just ridiculous. Oh, yeah, it's oh, rolling yeah. in, is it? It goes up so quickly. <clears throat> All right, I need to shrink my. Uh, I've not been paying attention. Shrink my infantry divisions a bit. I need to increase the size more. Mhm. Mm oh, everyone just went green. Oh god, they got bad supply. Of course they do. Darn. Menguquo and its crappy supply. <clears throat> I guess I should build some more. If I want to put all these men here, I should have paid more attention. Noticed that earlier. Let's just pull some guys back. Oh god, I've had them all suffering. <laughs> Silly attrition for quite a while. 
Whereabouts are your troops in Spain? Hmm? Oh, I don't know. I haven't been paying attention. Oh, right. Somewhere in the, in the south. I have local conflicts to worry about. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so... I think I've ceased to gain the benefit from prioritizing steel for guns. So if I switch this one, I get factory output. But the thing is, if I, if I spend... I could just spend all my political power on decisions right now, and I, I don't think... That doesn't seem wise. Probably not. So I'm going to turn these off. Yeah, so doing doing the um, that one's so increased workers' rights definitely work. I've now got 97% stability. Sweet. Oh, that's something like 13%. I'm rocking a hundred. I'm rocking a hundred, a hundred right now. Some Thirty percent more support. Living the life. Pull these guys back. Oh, there's still a cav unit in my nice infantry army. None of that. Yeah, you can go up here. One thing I don't quite get with the general stats. Mm hmm. No, no, no ignore me. <laughs> okay. Because <laughs> it says, it says, um, skill colon four. And I thought for a second that the planning stat was called skill, the skill stat. Uh, yes, I, I, uh, I had to say. I was about that, but it doesn't. I had the same confusion. That just says it for all of them. It should say attack two, defense two, uh, planning two, logistics two, three, or whatever. It would be nice. Yeah. Skill. I uh, I concur. All right, build some small divisions. I guess I'm going to need to build some military police divisions. All right, my my airplanes arrived. They have. All right, have at it. Where are you? I am in the south, pushing uh, towards Mercia. Cool. Well, no, sort of north, north, uh, east. Cool. I'm that bulge. I'm not getting that mental air experience. It's pretty good. How much have, how much have you got now? Well, I only had them up the last two days. Yeah, okay, have, I'm getting a fair amount. I have, I have 67 air experience. I am getting a fair amount, mind. actually, yeah. Yeah, it goes up quickly. <laughs> oh, I can also give them, uh, use some more ground crews, since I've got this command power going spare. I I was gonna say I'm gonna fight a very conventional war in China. I forgot about the supply issues. How I'm gonna really struggle to deploy many of my men on this front if I uh, if I just fight here. So I think I'm gonna scrap that idea and prepare to launch a big naval invasion in the south. Shanghai has a good port, doesn't it? Yeah. Let's go after Shanghai. These guys need a bit of training. All gone green because I shrunk the division size. Doesn't make them. We've, we've actually not got as priority currently in Spain. No, I saw that. They have. How does that work? We've got 105 fighters. To no, 18. it only shows yours. Oh, I see. Uh, I have. Our air detection is is bad, but this isn't great either. M it's because the Soviet Union. There's a load of playing for the Soviet Union, giving them 31 air superiority points. Oh, I see it now. Yeah. So can I? So the enemy planes? Is that only Spain's planes, or is that also the Soviets' planes? I don't know. To be honest. <laughs> but in terms of figuring out like superiority numbers, it's pretty easy to see. Just hover over the bar. I oh, know it, it shows, but it shows all the planes in the thing because it says current I, active enemy bombers. Are your are your guys what planes did you send? I have 80 fighters. Are they, do they have a mission? 80, um, support planes. Do they have a mission? Because they're currently not um, contributing to the air superiority. Oh, yeah, that's true. <laughs> they're supposed to be. There we are. They uh, they were doing absolutely nothing. <laughs> now, I now I have contested. Oh, I'm not showing contested. Well, I am, Christo. <laughs> I guess, like, we each act as individual entities and we affect our air superiority for our volunteers and Spain's for their troops, but not each other's. Could be the case, yeah. If you take the Madrid airbase, there we go, now I'm showing 98%. Yeah, yeah, the Soviets have withdrawn their bombers because they lost them, I guess. Mm, they can't lost no, all of them, didn't, not didn't, that quickly. Didn't seem to, no. no I, just wonder, I wonder whether they were just taking uh, heavy losses so they withdrew them. Maybe. They don't seem, they don't seem to have been. I see zero enemy bombers lost. Yeah. But that's just to my fighting. 
I'm just throwing my men into the mountains to grind experience. All right, do you want to do a tripartite? What do we have to be? I have to. Do I have to be at peace for this? No. I haven't done the tripartite pact. I don't think. No. Uh, I can do it. I don't know if you need to. If I do it, go for it. Is it tri uh, tripartite? Was Italy, Germany, and and? Uh, um, yeah, pretty sure. So I wonder if we can do it normally without. You included more people than three. Was it oh. was Italy? I think it was Italy, Japan, and Germany to start with. I could be wrong there, but and other people did sign it. The game crashed for some reason. The game crashed. Yeah. All right. Annoyingly. I'll um. I've got, you I'll take a save. I've got monthly auto saves. Yeah, we we, we were twenty days into a, into a month, Christy. I I can't I can't, I can't save it anyway. No, because it'll crash yours now, Precy. Um. That's weird. I never get um, game crashes without. Loads of mods and stuff. Well, I can save it now. Okay, if you like. I've taken the save. No, oh, cool. Okay. Cool, we can I'll switch host then. Host. Cool. I think it should be all right. Yep. Well, this is going well, isn't it, serious? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like about a black screen. Yeah, what what image should I put up as a splash screen? <laughs> go pick a random... This is what I normally do. You go, go pick a random screenshot while it's loading. <laughs> Alright, how about... It's not loading my screenshots now. How about this one? Game is up. I shall... Check out Sinky Yang. I swear Load I didn't... save up. I swear I didn't cheat, cheat to make this screenshot. <laughs> uh... Okay. How about a glorious screenshot from the anarchistic end of my... Uh... Is this an NC run? I think this is an NC run. <laughs> it's some weirdness going on. Sorry, because you, you can't see these, of course, so it's less. I can't. No. <laughs> it's a very riveting conversation you're having. <laughs> it's a screenshot of some horrendous border gore going across the Soviet Union. I think that was the end of my NC run. I love horrendous border gore. Mm. Anyhow. Almost loaded now. Same password if you're hosting. It is the same password as the one you were using. Fabulous. I don't know why. Maybe it's something to do with uh, playing volunteers. Um, I'm just thinking of new stuff. Guess. Just don't do it again, okay? <laughs> I'm not sure how much responsibility I'm taking this time. <laughs> Full responsibility. Full. This is outrageous. So you're going to send me volunteers to help out in China then? Uh, yeah, yeah, I can do. I've got. I've still got um, Guderian's Panzers. That Sweet. Doing nothing. I'll send planes as well. I want to rack up that air experience. I like that your name begins with uh, with A. It's easy to refresh the internet and just join your game. That way. Yes. Here he is. Should we kick him? <laughs> you must decide. Please, please don't. Yeah. Comment below. Vote now on your phones. <laughs> right. Ready up, Crypto. Come on. I'm trying. I'm trying. It's put me in the Soviet Union. Okay, I'm ready. Right. Do do do. Yes, yeah, so I have 127 air experience. That is really. pretty freaking good. Yeah. What's a, what do you normally um, increase on your uh, plane variants? Agility followed by uh, reliability, nothing else. Okay. Don't increase right. air attack because it decreases agility. And unpause, because it crash. <laughs> we can, but hope. We can. Man, it's been a while since I did multiplayer. I'm uh, not used to making decisions quickly. Yeah, I, 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 I'm playing um, like a competitive multiplayer 
done the other week mm -hmm. and tried to like do stuff on the fly without being able to pause. Yeah, it's tough. It's, it's, it's new for me and I find it really difficult. It's really hard, yeah. So I'm, so, I, I'm so used to just being able to pause, reconsider what I'm doing. Yeah. You, know, you just can't do it. I'm going to get a, uh, a reckless naval officer to help lead my naval invasion of, uh, of Shanghai. <laughs> this seems seems fine. I like reckless trait. Good trait. It's okay trait. Everyone ends up getting injured a lot. And it's quite yeah. bad when someone gets injured. I think I think someone commented once saying that if I was a Hoi 4 general, I'd have the reckless trait. <laughs> yeah. like, I think yes, they are definitely. very, very correct. I could have indiscriminate conscription. Yeah, I've already got Wine. 144 air experience now. Like, that's gone up by 20 in the one minute we've been playing. I can get 2% recruitable population? Ridiculous. From a decision. But it says while active. So I think I'd have to do it once every six months. Still, that's not bad. So I definitely feel like the um, gain from uh, volunteers needs to be nerfed with planes. The plane, plane air experience, yeah. It does seem pretty good, doesn't it? Well, the, well the, the main problem with it is that it's it's really out of balance with the amount you get for uh, land experience from doing it. You, you don't get nothing like that. Uh, I wonder how it's calculated if it's like per plane or something silly like that. Mm, could be it. Oh, I can actually have one more plane. Here. <laughs> All right, so we have, do we have the uh, new icons back? Yeah. All right, this is a, uh, a watery one. <laughs> I always do it this way. This is a watery field, uh, field marshal, so I give him the one with the little wavy blue lines. This is a, uh, it's a normal one. Hmm. Maybe it's partly because um, you, you gain an army experience and your divisions are in combat, but your planes are, all, are always counted as being in, on a mission. So they're always getting out army air experience all the time. Are they, or is it only when they're in combat? Well, it's, you know, it says it says it says in the description it says actual planes are used on missions and in contact with the enemy. Maybe that's mm. I can't work out whether that's on missions they gain and in contact they gain, or whether it's they only gain if they're in both of those things. It doesn't say. Yeah. I don't quite know how to read it. Uh, I want improved machine tools for sure. I'm going to try and circle Madrid here. Cool. I don't know, you, you're rushing. You should just grind in the Spanish Civil War. No... I'm not, I'm, I'm not rushing. There's no reason I have to... been grinding. Fair enough. Why are you here? Oh, because you're on this one. I see. How far are you away from uh, attacking uh, the Chinese? Uh, two and a half focuses. Until the Marco Polo Bridge incident. Which I think unlocks a decision which lets me... Yeah, unlock decision, escalate the war in China. All right, so someone's go they're going uh, Shanghai is Shanghai. Shanxi is going cooperation with the communists. Oh, Mao Zedong is doing focus on China rather than uh, prepare for war with Japan. Oh, it looks like he can do both though. Hmm. So I think Mao is about to declare war in Shanghai. <laughs> oh yeah. Sha I keep saying Shanghai. <laughs> Shang Tsi. Shang Tsi. Shang -Tsi. Yeah, I was gonna say, like, that's what I mean. I yes, excuse me. Shang Tsi's doing a cooperation with the communists. Yes. He wants to be friends, but you know, Mao's not having it. The Celestial Penetration Army. It's interesting. <laughs> interesting name. This is the first infantry okay. army. This is a rubbishy army. What, which, which symbol shall I use for the rubbishy armies? The hearts. Sounds good. Are you still using NATO symbols? Hmm? No, I turned it off. Ah. <laughs> I need... Uh, I think there is a mod which gives you a whole bunch of, diff of different NATO symbol variants. But the, the thing about NATO symbols is it doesn't... It, it gives you the default symbols, but there's no variants. So if you want yeah. to use two different things for infantry, you have to use a NATO symbol for one and then a rainbow for another, which just is wildly thematically inconsistent and looks bad. Yeah. Right. Let's upgrade my fighters. I should probably be doing land doctrine, shouldn't I? Yes. Yes, I should.
Um, have we implemented the uh, no more one instant doctrine switch thing yet? I think we have. I think I'm just going to go with... No, I like superior firepower so much recently. Wait, which doctrine is best nowadays? I think it's always been mobile warfare. Just because tanks yeah. are king. But uh, mass assault has a big buff in the last patch. Did, superior Grand Battle firepower. Plan got nerfed, didn't it? Grand Battle Plan and Superior Firepower massively nerfed, both in uh, indirectly. Grand Battle Plan because planning bonus declines so very rapidly these days. Mm. And uh, uh, fire, Superior Firepower because of the soft attack nerf on artillery. Because artillery, yeah. there was some kind of error where artillery were doing far more damage than they were supposed to. But still, I think Spear Fire Power is, is very good. Especially on the defensive, it's very good. Because Grand Battle Plan obviously only really helps massively on the attack with the planning. Yeah. Mobile Warfare gives by, by far the highest infantry organization, though. I'm just going to stay with Grand Battle Plan. Just because I've already got one researched and planning's fun. I haven't done any doctrine stuff yet. I need to do some doctrine research. Yeah, I just started. I'm going for my um, extra research slot at the moment. Mm. I got it uh, um, I got it last time. It's so how many days in this sub? Currently 796 days ahead of time. So which of these islands in the Pacific, if any, am I going to bother defending? I think the answer is none. What do you think I should try and rush down the USA? <laughs> that could be funny. Yeah, go for it. I could try. I could try that. I you should be... try. I should be building more... Uh, more planes, really. Oh, uh, so love of God. Please. Done already. I think, yeah. Crash. Oh, come off it, Christo. <laughs> Yeah. Why are you Why are you crashing so much? I don't know, but that is twenty minutes. So uh, I guess we'll come back next 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 episode and try and play again. Yep. Thank you for watching, right, everybody. We apologise. <laughs> we apologise. Apologises. I, I no, I don't apologise on my behalf. Uh, <laughs> and <laughs> see you next time. Bye bye.